Hey guys, my name is John Dalton. Welcome back to another video. Hope you guys all have an amazing day as always. And guys, today I need to talk to you guys about something because, I mean, it, with uh, general, like, you know, understanding, uh, I can totally see why people are super frustrated with w Wicked Penguin Bone Club. So pretty much here's the thing, guys. They just dropped, like, a, I don't know, what was that, like a week and a half ago, two weeks ago now? And I'm not kidding you. Like, they have done absolutely nothing for these penguins. They have literally done nothing. And, you know, honestly, it sucks for me. You know, I'm all tethered up in this. Uh, I thought the project was going to do well. But um, pretty much all they really care about right now is their stupid little, you know, 3D monsters, I guess. Like, that's all that they are focused on right now is these 3D these 3D guys on Ethereum. And, I, you know, it's kind of understandable. I mean, they have a whole bunch of people that are, you know, hyped up and ready for this. But they should not have dropped penguins if they were going to do this, dude, like they should not have dropped them. They should have just gone with this only. They should have only focused on this and not had any penguins or Solana drops at all. Like it's so stupid that they actually dropped penguins right before this was all going to happen because right now this is their main focus. They could care less about the penguins. Not only that, but look at this, guys. You know, people are saying like penguins in every like, you know, single announcement trying to say penguins, penguins, penguins because people are genuinely blowed and it makes sense. Penguins are like a 0.2 soul floor. That's absolutely disgusting for like, you know, they, they were a two soul mint. They focused on absolutely nothing for them. And they they said that they were going to have a roadmap last week. That never happened. They never showed us a roadmap. They, they never even had a roadmap or whatever. And it's just so stupid that like, you know, they just keep running this on and on and on. And pretty much you just got to wait until you know they say something about them right now there's absolutely nothing about them and you know this is all that they've really given so far is definitely not forgotten about i'm working hard behind the scenes to get you guys what you need and i won't stop i will still not give up on my team won't give up if you have anything to do with it i know you guys want updates and answers and they will come thank you for your loyalty and patience you guys are what makes wbc what it is nothing more without you that these are not dope so like come on like they have to just start moving start doing something you know he says that he's working behind the scenes and everything but like he he needs his actions to speak louder than words or else this this project is going to be a bust forever like they need to come up with some form of real utility i mean you can't just like promise promise giving little tidbits and then not actually follow through you know they explained i guess in the announcements like why they didn't have the roadmap i guess they did apparently according to the to the people behind the project but i don't know i i haven't checked into it enough to know about that but it just seems like they are they're just way too focused on this they should have never dropped penguins in the first place if they knew that they had all this to deal with and unless like they actually come up with some insane utility for these penguins, I really don't see them, you know, having a good time. It's a bad thing for their brand. Like they need this to work. They need this to happen. If they can't get this right, then they're not going to get other things right in the future, in my opinion. So, yeah, um, definitely wanted to tell you guys about this because it's really annoying to see that they have done absolutely nothing for this project or for the penguins in the project. And yet they have, you know, everyone and their mom looking at these 3D things these 3D guys over here. So they really just need to get their, their stuff together and actually bring some real utility for the penguins or else they're never going to recover from where they're at. You know, Solana is so saturated right now. You have to have quality or else you're just going to get picked on. Like that's, that's the reality. And yeah, it's a shame to see, but uh, I just wanted to make this video for you guys because, you know, I'm mad, you know, I'm obviously a part of this. So like I, I, I don't understand what's taking them so long. I don't like I, I get that like they have all this and they're focusing on this, but they should have never ever dropped penguins if they knew that this was all coming and they knew the workload that this was going to be. So yeah, definitely want to talk to you guys about it. Please let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. Uh, definitely more on the annoying side of things. I, I don't see why the team can't just bring together something, you know, just simple like for the penguins, like I, I just don't understand. So um, it's not like they don't have the market cap to do it either. I um, definitely want to talk to you guys about that. But yeah, uh, please let me know what you guys think in the comments. Guys, if you guys want to go check out uh, my project, I've been working super hard on it. And for some reason, um, we've actually just been getting like bots in the Discord. I don't know if that happens. Like at a certain point, like I guess you get your, your Discord big enough. But for some reason, bots have just been pulling in. And it's honestly annoying to me because like, you know, I've had bots on um, some of my videos have been botted before. Like uh, my, my most popular video has 4K views with like 400 something likes like that was obviously botted i don't know who sent them or who did that but i just i don't understand like the intentions behind that but then for some reason we're getting bots in our discord now which is so stupid because i mean i just have to wait seven days for them to go inactive like for that long so then i can prune all of them but like like that's not what i'm going for with my project i want it to be real organic and i want you to be able to see like that our numbers are accurate and it's not just like some like you know inactive users because you see some discords with like a thousand people online and they only have like 10 people in the discord so it's like 
it makes no sense to me. Uh, and that's the last thing I want to have happen uh, within my project. But yeah, I've been working super hard on it. Uh, it's been a really good time so far. You know, I've just been, you know, plugging away, making the rugger moon sheet for you guys. I've been answering your uh, project requests now, and that's going all well. Uh, we're also just have to refine a few things, make sure everything's going well. Uh, whitelist is going to be right around the corner. We're thinking about having, once we get a thousand people in the discord and then a thousand people on the Twitter, uh, we're officially going to start the whole whitelisting option. So then you guys can get in on that. That's going to be right here around the corner. And guys, we've just been keeping it completely transparent. We have real big ambitions for this project. You know, we're trying to bring as much quality that we can to you guys, because within the Solana ecosystem, you have to have something like of real quality. If like, it's actually going to go somewhere, especially with like the, the really like the depression bear market that people are feeling right now within the nft space uh especially when it comes to solana nfts it feels like everyone and their mom is just kind of depressed right now uh, about the current state of like solana nfts and how it hasn't just been in crazy insane pump season or whatever but like honestly i think it's just because like some coins have just been rallying too hard now that people want to liquidate it's just not looking good for nfts but eventually i, I you know i have faith that you know this is all going to come back into nfts at some point it's just a matter of time uh honestly i just see immense opportunity everywhere within the nft space especially right now with um, so many good projects in my opinion that are down and yeah i just wanted to talk to you guys about that please let me know what you guys think of my videos please give me honest feedback please like just go bully me i don't care like if you guys actually like need to tell me something please go tell me i love all feedback good and bad so yeah go um tell me that even on my bag heads project good and bad feedback always let me know and yeah, I'm just, I'm willing to hear any, you know, any of your opinions. They're all viable to me. So yeah, uh, I love you all. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe. Helps me out big time. Hope you guys all have an amazing day. Peace out. John Dalton.